Hello guys and welcome to our new uh, video tutorial series about Python uh, async IO yeah, and concurrent programming. Uh, the problem is that we want to achieve some concurrency uh, with the reading frames from the multiple uh, video resources or video cameras. Uh, and then we want to apply some face detection techniques to this frame and then show to the user. But the topic of this series is not how to do the face detection. So there is a myriad of resources in the YouTube itself. You can find how to achieve this using the OpenCV. The problem domain is that we want to minimize the lag between the cameras while uh, the reading frames and between the user interaction while we are showing uh, the read it frames, read it videos uh, to the user. So uh, say differently, we want to maximize uh, the, the video interaction between the user and make it as real time as possible. Uh, we are going to use a bunch of mm, technologies here, such as Docker, Docker Compose, so you need to install it uh, yourself. And let's just start. Uh, I'm going to create uh, the directory called at a concurrent camera reader so easy and let's just fire up our visual studio code and uh, create here docker file and let's just let's just start uh, building our image so we are going to use Python uh, 3.8 and that's why we are going to from and the work to itself is uh, app so what we uh, want to install I'm going to upgrade our pip upgrade pip uh, then uh, we need to install, uh, yeah, we need to install OpenCV. OpenCV Python. And with a specific uh, uh, version because uh, uh, on the upper versions uh, there is some bug. And I don't need that you are going to, uh, you struggle with it. So then some dependency package. And uh, also some other package as well. Uh, that's it for our Docker file. The next is uh, Docker Compose, Docker Compose file. So it is a YAML. And then um, what we have here, uh, yeah. So we are going to use the version is. And the services, the services name is async uh, reader. And the building from this, uh, the current Docker file, and then the tag name is uh, async camera, I don't know, one, uh, zero, the version, and uh, the environment variables we want to pass is. So we want to pass a display and uh, from the current display Oops. Mm, and we want to pass uh, this uh, Qt uh, thing that will eliminate uh, some uh, the errors with the window uh, showing this read it, the read it frames. So the next is like we want to mount uh, the volumes uh, especially uh, the local uh, my local webcam so this is a device so video uh, zero and we want to mount it inside uh, inside the docker image as well uh, another thing that uh, I'm going to mount this <coughs> x11 uh, temp file which will uh, enable us 
showing the frame read it inside the docker outside the, the, the host uh, machine uh, I'm going to use privileged so just note that this is local only and again mounting the device to the uh, docker image is not the preferred way I'm just using it here um, the next is I like networks which which networks we want to use and uh, the network name I have created them so uh, the network name is the wide network and the internal network and the command uh, to run while uh, when our mm, docker container is fire up is uh, I'm going to create some a dummy file with while true but prior to this uh, just define our uh, the networks so I'm going to just copy here nice let's save I'll we'll save everything and yes uh, we need this dummy pi file and it's itself like while true um, then pass that's it mm. the next thing uh, we want to add here is uh, the folder name is async frame reader which we are going to make uh, async uh, not now but uh, in the future videos and here is that uh, we will add video async file and also we want to not here but um, oops, but here the main pi so the main pi file uh, I think that uh, for the setup it's okay uh, the next step is uh, running this uh, build yeah running the build command for building our um, yeah for building our image so what we can run the docker compose and pass this docker compose file then build yeah uh, yeah what happened what happened so we have some error let's see uh, inside the docker yeah it should be equal equal nice should be equal equal oops and let's just fire up the build so successful build and tagged as uh, as described so you can see that docker image and it's here um, right uh, that's it and let's just uh, try to uh, uh, implement uh, some yeah no it just end up as uh, a setup video here and then the next video we are going to uh, write the code uh, where we will read uh, the frame from the single camera then uh, we will add some we will do some uh, sort of some sort of things uh, in the next video like adding the timestamp to the video then uh, applying uh, some face detection and then uh, trying to read uh, from two uh, from two cameras and that's it for setup video uh, yeah see you in the next video where we are going to read uh, the video from single uh, the integrated actually uh, the webcam of my laptop see you in the next video